DJ here with Achieve Peak, and today we're going to be going through a full body, high intensity training workout, not to be confused with a high intensity interval training. This is high intensity training. We are going to be going to failure on each and every set. We're going to go through 11 exercises in total for just one set each. Our working time is going to be 80 seconds and our break time is only 20 seconds. Again, this workout is not meant to be easy. We are going to try to reach failure every single exercise we do. So be prepared for that and come with a good heavy weight. All right, if you like this workout, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and let's get to work. All right, we got about 20 seconds until we get started with our warm up. If you have a fitness tracking watch, be sure to start your workout now. Our first warm up we're going into is a body weight squat with arm raise. So, what we're gonna do is drop down as we come up, get the arm raise, come back down. Here we go. So, body weight squat to arm raise. Body weight squat, arm raise. Nice and easy. Don't forget to breathe. We're gonna get our feet out wide. For the next one, we're gonna go in to trunk circles. Here we go. So what we're doing is rotating down and around, back, around and down, kind of stretching out everything in the trunk area, which is this area right here. We're going into lateral lunges right here. So coming down, back up, switch sides. Here we go. Try to keep that chest out, head up. It's okay to kind of lean forward as long as it happens at the hips and not at the lower back. Here we go. We're going to chest openers here. So slide bend in the elbows. Pulling back, opening that chest up. There we go. We got arm swings coming up after this. There we go. Start with some nice little circles. Moving into larger circles. If you want to reverse it, go the other way. You can now. Sure, I'll do it today. Why not? Change it up. We can get those feet out wide again. We're going to go into toe touches next. Here we go, dropping down, touch the toe, come back up. Here we go. If you want to have a slight bend in the knees, that's totally fine. If you want to keep the knees straight, that's totally fine. One more. All right, we got 20 seconds. We're going to go into static lunge, left side first. So we're going to have our left leg forward here. Right leg back, we're gonna get in this split squat or split stance position. We're gonna hold it here. So what I'm gonna do is actually just kind of make sure I'm on my mat. Here we go, we're dropping straight down, coming up. Just barely tap the knee, try to come back up. Good controlled movements here. Don't slam the knee down. If it does get a little too tough, you can drop one dumbbell and keep working. If it's still too tough, drop both. Another option is just to take a quick, short break. So if you need to take a break, just a one, two. Try to get one more rep at least. Here we go. Don't forget to breathe. Here we go. Halfway. Remember, the goal is failure today. Woo! Come on. There we go. Keep pushing. My leg's on fire. Come on. Come on. Push it out. 20 seconds, switching sides. Ooh, that was no joke right there. 
All right, we're just switching sides here. So right leg forward, Whew, static lunge. Whew, here we go. I stand up. Whew. Come on. Dropping down and up. Down and up. Oh, yeah. Push yourself. Today is one of those days where you prove to yourself what you're made of. Sometimes we give up a little too quick. Today's gonna test that. Test your grit. Let's go. Come on. Keep pushing. Let's go. 20 seconds. Keep pushing. Come on. Good controlled reps. Chest out. Last one. Ugh. Woo! Oh, we got push ups next. Oh, good stuff right there. Push ups coming up. If you want, you can do a lying chest press. Here we go. Dropping down, coming up. If it gets too tough and you're on your toes, you can always drop down to the knees. Try to keep going. Another option, if you want to stay on those toes, drop down, give a one-two count, push back up. Let's go. Come on. Halfway. Whew. Keep pushing. Breathe. Keep those elbows in. We got one more in us. Here we go. Bit over rows. Coming up next. Go to the left side only. So, add a little weight to my dumbbell here. Put my elbow on my knee right here on my thigh. Coming up, back down. Up, back down. Here we go. Don't forget to breathe. Good controlled reps, control it up, control it down. If you need to take a break, drop it, one, two, three. Try to come back, get another rep. We try to rest about three seconds before trying for another rep. Definitely don't rest longer than 10 seconds. Come on. Keep pushing. Last one. Woo. Switching sides. Good stuff. 
Great reps right there. Right side coming up. Here we go. Palms are facing our body. All the way up, all the way down. Exhaling as we pull the dumbbell up. There we go. Come on. Keep pushing. Come on. You got this. Let's go. We're supposed to be getting our butts kicked right now. So enjoy it. Try to smile. Let's go. One more. Here we go. All right, we got front squats coming up next. We'll drop down, wait just a little. Here we go, so curl our weight up, dropping down, coming up, dropping down, coming up. Here we go. Just like that. Come on. If it's a little too tough to hold, you can always kind of rest your dumbbells on your shoulders if you need. You can also do this with a single dumbbell as well. Let's go. Come on. Keep pushing. 30 seconds. Legs feel like jello. <laughs> Come on. Keep that back straight. 15 seconds. As you push up, keep those knees out. Don't let them buckle in. Last rep. <sighs> Woo. Here we go. Shrugs coming up. <sighs> Get that sweat out of there. <sighs> Five seconds. Here we go. Grab our dumbbells. Bringing the shoulders up, coming down. Try to keep that head up. Come on. You got this. Breathe as you come up, exhale. Get that head up, don't pull it down, don't strain the neck. 30 seconds. Here we go. Come on. Try to get that little hold at the top. One more. Woo. Here we go. We got RDLs coming up. 
Oh, my legs are a little shaky. <laughs> Come on. So RDLs, grab our dumbbells. If you want, you can use one dumbbell. Slight bend in the knees, bending at the hips, dropping down, coming up. Dropping down, coming up. Keep that back nice and straight. I don't want to see you doing this. We're not doing that, nope. Right here, head out. Keep that chest pushed out. It's gonna help prevent that lower back from bending. Stretch out those hamstrings. Come back up. Let's go. Breathe, come on, halfway. Whoo. Chest up or chest out, head up. Squeeze. Use those hamstrings to pull you back up straight. Come on. One more rep. Here we go. We got bicep curls coming up. Lighten our weight just a little. All right. So, wipe the sweat real quick. Just dripped into my glasses. Here we go. Palms facing out. Coming up. Back down. Up. Back down. Here we go. For reference, I've been using 25 pounds, 35 pounds, and 45 pounds. Here we go, come on. Push it out. Come on. If you need to, you can alternate left and right. You can even just do a little simple left, right, middle, left, right, middle, if you want. Come on. Let's go. Woo. One more. Woo. Here we go. All right. We're going to lay on our backs here. Just going to sit those like that, make it easier on myself. We're going to do a lying tricep extension so if you want you can just use a single dumbbell that's fine we're gonna do here start with them just above your head i'm up back down tap go so try to keep your upper arm at a slight angle towards your head never bring the weights perfectly vertical we don't want them here the most we want them is right here to help keep constant tension on those triceps. There we go. Good controlled reps, come on. Keep pushing. If you need to take a break, then you can just let them rest on the ground for a quick second or two. Come on. 15 seconds. Let's go. It's just like a hard stop. One more. There we go. Woo. Good stuff right there. We got shoulder press coming up. 
those triceps, it's like you're going, going. Nope, it ain't going no more. Here we go. Shoulder press. Bring our hands up, palms facing out away from us. Here we go, pushing up, humming down. Here we go. Let's go. <laughs> Come on. If you need to, use those legs. Kind of drop down. Explode up. Slowly lower. Also, you can always alternate left and right. Come on. Ah, oh, gotta take a quick break. One, two, here we go. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Keep pushing, do whatever you can. Let's go. One more. Ah. All right, last one. Ah. All right, final one. Lying reverse crunches. Here we go. What we're gonna do here, lay on our back if you want. Put those hands up under the butt, feet out, head up, bringing the legs up, back down. Try to get that little hip off the ground right there. Make sure to exhale when you bring the knees up. When those hips come off the ground, squeeze the core. Here we go. Come on. Head up. Don't drop that head. We want to keep our lower back flat on the ground. Come on. If you need to take a little break, that's fine. Drop those feet down. A couple seconds, get back into it. Here we go. Come on, focus on that core. Let's go. 20 seconds. Come on. Couple more. Last one. Woo. Great job today. Oh. Stuff to even get up. My arms and shoulders are on fire. Great job today. Whew. Pretty sure I said we only had 11 exercises at the beginning. That was a lot. We have 12. My bad. <laughs> Do a little extra one in there. Hope you guys enjoyed that today. If you did, be sure to smash that like button, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you on the next one. See you guys.